What's going on guys, Vay20 here, and welcome back to the NASCAR Thunder 2004 Career Mode. So we're going on to the Brickyard 400, 21st race this season. Here's what the standings are looking like. So Dale Jarrett has been pretty much the same three guys at the top, kind of trading back and forth. Uh, so Dale Jarrett, Tony Stewart, and Dale Jr., Ryan Newman, Kevin Harvick, Mark Martin, Je uh, Jeff Gordon, Jeff Burton, Michael Waltrip, and Sir Lynn Marlin. Uh, look at the rest of it here. We're going to scroll through here quickly to get down to where we're sitting at. It's, it's a... It's a ways down here, but, uh, oh, hey, 41st now. Not bad. We finally passed Chase Montgomery. It only took, uh, however many races. Uh, let's see. Does it show how many? Okay, it doesn't show how many races we've run. Um, or, well, how many he's run. Obviously, we've run all of them. Here we go. Okay. So, here's, uh, <laughs> this is going to be really embarrassing, but, so, Ashton Lewis has five starts on the season. Uh, Kevin Grubb has seven. Stan Barrett has eight. Uh, David Green has eight. Chase Montgomery has 12. Oh, man. Chase Montgomery only has 12 starts, and we are barely ahead of him in points. We have three poles, though. Anyways, look at the garage here. So we got five races left on an overhaul for a chassis. Uh, that's, uh, yeah, so, so we did get Jay Miller. He's our new chassis guy. So that uh, once that is done overhauling, that should be a pretty solid chassis once it gets going there. Uh, so we got two races left on our fourth engine build. Again, we still have our newest one there, 57 power. Uh, and our bodies, we've got four races left on the overhaul there. I believe, yeah, he's, he's new as well. So uh, that should be pretty solid once that finishes up. And, of course, we got five races left on the shop edition. Fabrication shop, once that gets going, we'll get 10-plus uh, more body down for us, and we can develop two more bodies. So that's really about it. Sponsors are all still on there, so let's go ahead and hop into it. Welcome to MRN's live coverage from the famed Indianapolis Motor Speedway for today's Brickyard 400. NASCAR Winston Cup Racing from the Brickyard. It doesn't get much better than this, Barney. This track's tradition alone is what inspires the drivers to do well here. What a great feeling it must be to stand in victory lane at Indy. We'll see here shortly who that lucky man is gonna be. Kenny Wallace really needs a good finish in this race. He's got a long way to go on the points list. And how frustrating that must be. You're working just as hard as everyone else, yet you just can't seem to finish well on race days to gain the valuable points you need. These guys need a good finish just to regain their confidence as a team. The Windcraft car has not had much of a year so far on these speedway tracks. Boy, that's the truth. That makes it even harder to focus on race day. He needs a good finish today to regain some confidence in himself. Well, guys, well, oh, man, up for the start. I hope we, we finish well here. This race pay is pretty good. So, I don't know. I'm not very confident in myself, but we're going to give it our best here. 40 laps. Let's get it. Oh, boy. I think we got a fast car once again. We just got to hit our marks and not dick it up too bad. Yeah, easy does it. That's all we're going to try to do today. Easy does it. Take care of the car. Okay. Normally, I would have slid up underneath there, but we're going to try to take it easy. There we go. All right. We're just, we're just going to chill for now. Yeah, it's definitely not very fast on the straightaways, I'll tell you that. But I'm going to try my best to really back up these corners. I'll take it easy. Oh, come on. Turn, you heifer. All right. Yeah, we're going to have to be a little bit more patient with the car. Because sometimes it likes to turn, sometimes it doesn't. But, uh, all right, well, we haven't hit anything. Lap one, not bad. All right, don't mind me. I'm going to take a short take shortcut through the grass. Times. It's really hard to see turn one, I'll tell you. Yeah, there's like a bad shadow going off in there. It's hard enough to get it to turn in and, you know, get it where I want in the beginning of the corner. Yeah, that's even harder. <laughs> you can't even see where the hell you're going. Wow, that thing is bad in turn three. That thing did a whole lot of things right there. It's pretty, pretty solid through turn four, although I dicked it up there. I overcorrected a little bit. Okay, wow, lap two coming to lap three. 
Still haven't hit anything. That's pretty good. Yeah, right there, I hit my mark. Oh, there it is. Lap three. One to save it a lap three. Three for Dale. Hit the wall. Oh, that's that's not where I was going with that. That's not what I meant. <laughs> well, anyways. Um, yeah. Pretty much by myself now. I can barely see people up there. This is tough, man. I'm trying my best to hit hit my marks. I'm not really using the brakes, but it still sort of kind of wants to do that. And man, it shows really bad. So, not only am I doing just I'm just trying my damnedest just to hit my marks. I mean, that's still not quick enough to keep up with the back half of the field. So, yeah, we got some we got some serious problems here at uh, Moving Chicane Motorsports. There we go, now it turns. Man, it still almost hit the wall, okay. Well, the good thing is, I think this is gonna be a one-stopper for us. I mean, geez, 10 laps in, we're halfway on fuel, and we're already half a lap down. So, assuming we should go one lap down. Yeah, we should be good to make it on one stop. Pit around lap 20, I think. And then be good to go to the end, so. At least there's that. Yeah, this sucks, man. We're just like so bad. <laughs> oh man, like I'm trying to think. Like I'm, I'm kicking myself because I feel like I could be better, but I, I don't really know how much better I could really be with this car. I mean, I backed the corner up so damn much, and it's still just kind of like four wheel slides. That's the problem. It's like no matter what I do to try to get off into the corner, it always has something, something to do. So like if I back up the corner, it just chucks loose. But if I if I dive it off in the corner so it won't get loose, it shoves, obviously. So there's no like happy medium. I can't just like you know drive off in the corner and turn like I should be able to. So uh, I gotta Easy, buddy. That left front tire seat, some action. I gotta go. I gotta do a lot of extra stuff just to be able to make it into the corner the way I should be able to, and you know carry speed. Like there is there is just it's it's just not right. Wow, okay, I'll take the access road. That's what happens when I turn to hit the brakes at the same time. I shit you not. Maybe I could do that. I might be quicker if I did that every time. Just, like, cut through the grass. I mean, that's, that's crazy. It shouldn't be doing that. Oh, man. Might be time for a new left for your tire. You sure you're a professional? You sure you're a crew chief? How you put me in this such shit a car? Fuck, I hit my... I, for the first time ever, I hit my marks in turn four. And the thing still fucking shoved and somehow managed to find a way to hit the fucking wall like it's gonna do right here. In the same fucking spot, it does every fucking corner. How? How is the car that bad? Fucking shit. Are you sure you're a crew chief? I'm gonna go a lap down in like less than 20 laps in Indianapolis Motor Speedway. That's unfucking real. We're not even gonna make it a lap 20. Somehow, some way, we hit half fuel right there around lap 10. But uh, yeah, fuck, I gotta hit pit road. I'm not gonna make it back around. Number eight is outside. Woo, boy, that was, jeez. All right, four tires. Yeah, fix their damage. Full tank. Sure, yeah, let's make it looser. I mean, I don't know what else I can do to this car, but... This is just so frustrating. We're just so far off the back markers. That's what pisses me off. How? <laughs> I can't do I can't do anything with this car. I can't. I can't fucking do it. This is a race I should just start in parts. Like, this, this is beyond ridiculous. Beyond ridiculous. I can't do anything with that. I just can't get in the corner. And that fucks up the entire corner. We're not fast on the straightaways, so we get through the corner so shitly that when we come off the corner, we're even slower on the straightaway. Fuck it, I don't give a shit about the access road. I'm pulling the fuck up. God bless America. Now this thing's probably gonna be too loose. That's the problem. We loosen it up because it's tight, but it already drifts through half of the corner just because it's stupid. There you go. We're just gonna Tokyo drift around everything, every corner. I mean, it actually sort of kind of did something right there, but... Oh yeah, it's definitely got a lot of turn in it, for now. Go ahead. 
There you go. Can't believe I actually made that corner. It is feeling a little bit better though. Not much, but it's feeling a little better. It's definitely loose. Yeah. You see how slow we are down the straightaway. I'm the only one to lap down. Feels bad. Mm, it just does that. It's okay. I do feel a little bit quicker. These guys aren't totally like blowing by me. Except for maybe Ricky Rudd. He's on a mission. Yeah, here he comes. Alright, hey, well. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I feel a little bit better now. I guess we are on fresh tires. Yeah, it's just tough. Because I, I get off into the corner pretty close the same way these guys, and then it's just like. Those guys make the corner, and I don't. I'm not sure what it is about this car that just makes it all of a sudden just like four wheel slide like it wants to wreck, but. <laughs> like, how? How? How, do, how does these things happen? How do you bring a stock car to, the, to to IMS that wants to do that every corner? And how do you expect somebody to drive that? I don't, I don't, I don't understand. I can understand it being slow. But, I mean, it's slow. And on top of that, it wants to drift in four-wheel side every corner. Like, oh, my God. Yeah, nobody's blowing up yet. That sucks. I'm, I'm, I'm trying, man. Um, man, if, you, if, if only you knew how many times I heard that. Not only this race, but this entire season. It's really pissing me off. I'll tell you that. There you go, Bill. All right. Wow, that's the best I've ever gotten through turn one right there. Oh, fuck, and I took my, I took my eyes off the, the road there for a minute. Forgot I still had to turn a little bit. Oh, yeah. All right, well. Again, we haven't totally killed it, so that's that's good. I have smacked the wall like a million and one times. See, I, I just need to accept that I'm slow. But it's just hard to accept that I'm like... Two seconds off, like 41st and 42nd. Hey, like how? I just, I just, I just can't accept that. How we're that far off some of those guys at a, at a track like this. But I mean, it just goes to show you, it's how important it is getting your turn in down. I just wish we could do it. Oh my God, I'm making passes. What? Fucking up! Oh, da da da! Fucking! It's like turn one every time. Yeah, these guys short pit, I bet. They pit a second time, that's why I got from them. What time is it? It's like 10.30. I'm sorry, I'm recording on 4th of July. I live out in the country, so neighbors been shooting off fireworks and guns for the past week. That includes 10.30 tonight. Thought it'd be late enough I could start recording, but no! Well, remember this moment. 38th, and I'm not running last. Because uh, here very soon I'm going to have to pit. And uh, I'm gonna lose it, and I'm gonna finish last, I think. That's unreal. How it gets loose, and then I just like try <laughs> tries to go to the grass. Oh man, you want to turn me around? You think I could get a caution? That would be sweet. There's my caution. Yeah. And I'm dead. Oh my god, I'm flipping, but I'm not. Uh, I'm dead now. No, I'm not. I'm still not dead. You're gonna flip me over. We're gonna finish this thing, right? Yes! I'm not dead. We're fixing this thing up, and we're gonna hopefully not finish last. I don't know. Okay. Wow. Yeah, you're not gonna flip many times and finish. Shout out to the durability on this thing. This is why we got new, 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 um. New builders. That's some sturdy shit right here. Oh, we're flapping. We're flapping. Oh, oh. Sorry, Kevin. Oh, we're, lo <laughs> we're losing debris. That's okay. Yeah, let's go ahead and fix this thing up. We're going to be able to make it to the end on fuel now as well. Hell yeah, and I'm not running last. Yeah, all right. I've never been so happy to half flip and crash in my life. I knew that was a risky move, piling back up there, but... These guys just don't check up. <laughs> oh my god. I'm so lucky that didn't kill me for the rest of the race. 
here I was on lap two or three trying to take care of my equipment and I hit the wall and here I am 20 laps later resulting to pull back up in the field and flip yes I like to put under caution all right all four fair damage yeah 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 all right so we got some guys staying out I mean everybody should be able to make it on fuel from here so uh, we're not really worried about that, but hopefully that took out some people in that crash. That's what we're gonna Hope for <laughs> Oh man, yeah fix this thing up as best as you can Boy, we got a lot of repair work to do the thing is not looking good That craftsman logo is hardly hardly hanging on there. Oh, yeah, look man. Look, oh, there you go. Yeah, flatten that back out Nice work boys. Nice work. Looking better than ever. Okay, not really, but it's not bad. Alrighty, oh boy, lap cars the inside, sweet. Oh, I'm 32nd, sweet. Well, okay, well, this is probably the end of my life, honestly. I don't, yeah, I don't see his, I don't see his lasting very well, or very long, or very well. Oh gosh, the problems! Yay! Steve, Jeff, I keep calling you Steve. Jeff, stop it. Jeff, I swear to fucking God, dude. Quit it. All right? Well, somebody lost some debris, I guess. You and your damn tires, man. All right, let's make it back here without crashing. All right, man, I lost a lot of spots. Hold it steady. Three wide. Oh, God, are we about to wreck again? Coming to the line? What the hell is that? All right, who was it? Was it me? I bet it was me. I don't think it was me. Oh, Ashton Lewis. <laughs> All right. Well, might as well get four more tires of fuel. I think I want to tighten it up a little bit because I'm a little worried that it's uh, a little out of control here, so. Yeah, I think uh, it's pretty obvious no matter what we do here, the car is going to be slow. So let me tighten it back up and make sure I don't crash out of this. And uh, yeah. uh, let's, let's tighten that up just to go. Shut out to do it. Alrighty, well here we go. 42nd. So it doesn't look like we're going to finish last, are we? We don't have too many laps to go here. Man, Jeff Green really doesn't like me. I'm sorry about that, man. Oh, hey. All right, so we got one car out. Oh, that's good. Um, yeah, I mean, I'll take that. This is gonna be, oh, damn it. I overcorrected right in the wall. Yeah, we should, um, I mean, this race pays pretty good. I think we're gonna get a little bit more money than usual for finishing about where we usually finish, so that ought to help. Once again, yeah, we've only got like 20,000 in the bank, so we're gonna need everything we can get. Man, it'd be nice. I don't know how bad Ashton Lewis is hurt. Yeah, I don't think it really matters at this point, so I'm just going to try to sort of kind of go hard. That includes drifting. I'm trying to hit my marks. Oh, it looks like Ashton Lewis is off the pace a little bit. Is this Ashton Lewis or is he the next one? I can't really tell. This looks like Greg Biffle. Is that Greg Biffle? Yeah, it is Greg Biffle. Cool. Looks like Greg Biffle's off the pace. Jeez. Can't see where the hell I'm going. Oh, that was the best I've ever gotten through turn one right there. Here we come. I think we might be able to get on up in here and actually make a pass. Shots of the fresh tires sort of kind of helping. Oh yeah, down the back. Suck a little bit of draft. A little bit. Okay, never mind. It's just quicker than, than me down the straightaway. Luckily, I'm getting through the corners a little bit better than he is. Oh yeah. There you go. I think I'm, it definitely helps now. It's to the point now where not really worried about tires, so I'm just kind of going through the corners however the fuck I want. It just turns and turns up until it doesn't, man. Oh, I hate that. I hate it. I wish it would just turn. I just, I just want to turn. I have more to go to catch Greg Biffle, and we are like barely quicker. But I think we lost enough ground at this point. I don't think it. Yeah, here we go. Now, now, now. Yeah, yeah. one more time. Yep, yeah, hit the wall. Same spot. I always hit it. Again, it turns, turns, turns. Oh, oh, sorry. Not turning anymore. Here's a wall. Oh, man. I didn't think I'd actually hit it that time, but I still hit it. 
God, man, I'm getting quicker, but the car is just not helping out. This is so bad. I thought I could catch Greg Biffle. And I'm still trying, but every time, man, a four-wheel slide, easy. Got to save him tires if you want some grip for later or whatever. All right, well, white flag. I'm pretty proud that I sort of kind of kept up with Greg Biffle. If you take away all those times I hit the wall there trying to catch him. I am on fresher tires, but I don't know. I could, I, I think I could have passed him if I didn't dick it up too many times. But looks like we're only going to finish the lap down, so that's not bad. I did, I did get a little bit better. We had our moments. If it wasn't for me crashing, I think I would have finished last. So. Luckily, we crashed our way to one spot higher in 42nd. Yeah. I tried, man. I tried. I gave it my all, but... Jeez, the, the car is really not helping out, man. This is really not. So Again, it's a long process. we still got a good chunk of the season left. we still got a lot of components on their way, developing and overhauling. We will be better. This just isn't one of our tracks. It's kind of like Pocono, in a sense. This just doesn't really suit us very well. So there you have it. Hope we I hope 40 second pays pretty well. God, that was ugly. Yeah, I hope so. Oh boy. All right. Well, Ricky Rudd won. <laughs> he was pretty quick coming through there. The fans love to see. All righty. Well, Jimmy Johnson's calmed down a little bit. <laughs> Other than that, I guess we just got to worry about Christopher Fittipaldi and Jeff Green now. So. Uh, yeah, not too terribly bad there, but uh, we were able to avoid most everybody for the most part. Oh, well, that's uh, oof. wow, wow, 80,000 for finishing 42nd. That's pretty solid right there. Uh, sponsor income was a little weak, 55,000, so um, yeah, that kind of sucks, but uh, ooh, that team payroll that really that really hurt so. These were up to 72,000 now, so that's not too bad. But uh, look at the finishing results. So, yeah, Ricky Rudd with the win. Uh, we'll go ahead and scroll through here real quick. And uh, so we finished 42nd. Yeah, you, you guys know the rest of it. I don't know what happened to Mayfield. I guess he was part of the the crash that I caused. But uh, either way, happy uh, happy we didn't finish last. Man, I just uh, we could have got Greg Biffle. I'm getting, I'm getting better. The car is getting better. I'm getting better. I just got to be better on the sticks and got to be better. I uh, got to bring a faster car. And just like that, I lost like half of my sponsors. So let's go off in here and uh, let's see. We still got Craftsman on there. All right, cool. Oh, wait. No, this actually. Oh, man. We're going to have to put an icon on there. 35th in points. There's, there's, That's like not even possible. 35th in earnings. We got to put an icon on there. Team, still got team on there, so we still got Windcraft on there a couple of times, but uh, yeah, so we got four races left there, six, and that's the newest one, four, and four, so in four, race, four races from now, I'm going to lose, like, everybody else, all but, like, one sponsor, so, <laughs> oh, man. Alrighty, so, uh, back here in the garage, so, I set another engine to overhaul, uh, so that's got six races left, uh, so that... Should make it a good bit better. Obviously, it's going to take a while till we get that in there. But uh, this has one more race left on it, this uh, fresh engine build. Um, so that will come into play after Watkins Glen. Um, and the bodies, we still got three races left on the overhaul there as well. All right, well, that about do it. We're going on to Watkins Glen. I'm pretty excited about that. I uh, feel like we could probably not finish last there. So uh, that ought to be pretty fun. But, uh, yeah, there you guys have it. Hope you enjoyed today's video. It was, uh, well... <laughs> I mean, other than our half flip, oh boy, it was a rough one, but, uh, well, there you guys have it. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure to leave a like on it if you did. It helps me out a ton, but, uh, we're on a Watkins Glen, so I feel like we can not finish last there, so I'm excited for that, but, uh, but yeah, that'll do it. Appreciate y'all as always. I'll see you guys in the next video.